So, I have been wanting to make this video for a while now. As you guys can see by the title of the video, I'm going to be getting the Diamond Rod and the Sea Emperor. And I'm going to be trying to make the Sea Emperor shiny as well. So, in order to boost our chances, we can go over here to the Black Marketplace. And I actually learned this while watching Carbon Meister Plays, his video. And if you come right here to the Black Market Shop, like between the black market and the uh what is it called the beacon you jump over here somewhere and you jump if i can do it that is um you jump over here somewhere come over here jump up here and then you come to this edge right come to this edge right right here if i can make it up or i just keep climbing up and then keep climbing up here and then once you make it up here there's a ladder right here just go down here and then this chest you see right here i haven't collected it yet but apparently once you collect it, you'll get five cherry. Yep, you get five cherry and all the other stuff. So that cherry is going to be helpful once once I'm trying to make my uh, sea emperor shiny. So yeah, big... Oh, what, what is this? Legendary cube 100 million? Yeah, I don't need any more of those. I don't think. I think I have like around 100. Uh, yeah, I don't need any more of those. All right. So all we need is to catch 55 legendaries from the magma place and the last uh, legendary and then we'll be done with the diamond rod quest and the Seamber quest. So I'll get back to you guys once I finish both of those. So I just realized that as I was editing for the quest, I said legendary fish for this quest. I meant to say epic fish, but uh, anyways we finished the diamond rod quest i know i did say that i was going to try and get both of them at the same time but i feel like a diamond rod quest i mean the diamond rod is going to help me get the legendary fish even faster so we'll complete that quest first sunset shore right here let's go ahead and complete the last quest technically right does he have more he has more but like this is technically the last quest so we just got the diamond rod and a bunch of other cool stuff uh this thing basically the diamond rod <laughs> we don't really care much about that stuff all right so let's go over here let's go back to the magma place and check out the stats for the diamond rod because i still do need the, the legendary for this map right here once i get the legendary then i'll finally be able to get the thing <laughs> the thing yeah the thing the z emperor so the speed increased the treasury the treasure increased I'm not sure if the i think the luck did increase and then the i don't think this that this thing increased because this thing's from pets so the luck the treasure and the speed increased to pretty good amounts i guess it's not that bad so basically you're probably going to get a treasure almost all the time because it's like 85 percent but yeah this is basically the new stats for the diamond rod. I'll see you guys whenever I get the Sea Emperor. Alright, so I left my computer on overnight, and as you can see, we did get the legendary. We only got one though, pretty sure. Uh, items, fish, I mean. Yeah, we only got one, the blobfish. <clears throat> pretty sure that's it. Alright, so now we can go back to the uh, fisher dude, and then, well, not the, the dude, but like, at that place and then we can get the sea emperor which should be right here sunset shore all right so right here we should be able to claim it claim reward you discovered the sea champion <clears throat> all right so what is it right here seven thousand eight hundred and fifty nine man i am late some planes getting kind of late though but these are the stats for him i'm gonna try and max him out let's see if i can max him out yeah this should definitely be enough to max him out I have 356,000, so that should be enough to max him out, right? I lied! Oh my gosh, holy! That was a huge lie. Alright, so we were gonna try and get him shiny, so let's try and let's try and make him shiny. Uh, give treat. I have 16, hopefully that's enough. Let's go one at a time and see if I can make him shiny. It's like I'm too lazy to just do it until shiny. Alright. We ended up being able to make him shiny. Let's go. Nice, nice. I, I knew I was going to, you know, like, I knew I could do it. <laughs> Wasn't nervous at all. Not at all. All right. So let's go ahead and equip our damage team. And then go over. Man, it's thundering outside. Equip best. 
And there he is, the C champion. Oh, there we go. That looks so cool. Alright guys, so I've decided to not max him out because that is going to take a long, long time. Because this guy requires millions and millions of XP just to level up one time. I thought I was going to try and get two more knowledge scrolls because I have 14 and I just need two more to max him out. But that's also going to take a long time and I want to get this video out. So I'm just going to end this video here and uh, show you guys my stats first. Let's go get rid of that. So I'm going to go over here, options, uh, stats. So these are my stats right now. I've been playing this. Is, is this like overall player time? My overall playtime is about a day and 11 hours, so I haven't played for that long. I spent 20 hours fishing to complete the quest. <laughs> and then, uh, where is what I was looking for? Robux. Where's the Robux spent thingy? Uh, am I blind? Hold on. Wait, wait, wait for it. Oh, it's right here. Robux spent zero. So I haven't spent any Robux yet. I kind of want to get up to this point where I have the diamond rod and see him for free to play and then i'm gonna spend robux so i'm probably gonna like th this is probably gonna change pretty soon but yeah anyways i just want to show you guys my stats before i end the video but that's gonna be it for this video thanks for watching uh peace out